The Queen first wore this dress in 1972 on a state visit to France at the Palace of Versailles. The dress has a really beautiful double face satin skirt. This means that the fabric is really sumptuous and it's a very pale mauve colour which Hardy Amy said he'd only ever seen before in alpine violas. And the Queen chose to wear this dress in the iconic 1977 Silver Jubilee image. And this image was widely reproduced. It was used on commemorative items. It was also used by Andy Warhol in his Reigning Queen screen print images. And also by the Sex Pistols on their God Save the Queen album cover. And can you imagine the extra added pressure that must be on a designer going to the home of couture? You know that the press and every person is going to be so critical of every bit of the design that you're dealing with. And so how's the Queen going to stand out? Well, I think that Hardy Amy's, who is known for his day wear, really not evening wear, has really knocked it out of the park here. And with this, I think he's taking a note from Hartnell, especially with the elaborate beading that you see. He's got this amazing detail in the beadwork. The entire bodice is covered. Is it with pearls and different sizes of crystal? And it really will shimmer under the light. 